Hi, I'm Amanda Sikarski, author of Digital Research Methods in Fashion and Textile Studies, and these are my top five tips for doing fashion research online. Number five, go in reverse. If you have an image that you want to research but don't know key terms pertinent to searching, like the name of the designer or collection, do a reverse image search to find other examples of the same image online. Number four, size matters. If dress objects in a database aren't pictured on a model or mannequin, it can be difficult to get a sense of scale. When this is the case, check the object's metadata to see if the dimensions of the object are given. Number three, make it Boolean. Try using all uppercase and if you want to find records with both terms, punk and shoes, or all uppercase or if you want to find records with either search term, Tokyo or Harajuku, and using an asterisk at the end of a truncated search term will make it a wild card, finding results with all the different suffixes for the word. For example, swim asterisk would be sure to return results for both swimsuit and swimwear. Number two, get social. Sometimes it feels good to get out of a database environment and do some light research via social media. Period-specific hashtags are super helpful in finding historical fashion posts on Twitter and Instagram. Try hashtag Renaissance Core for the Renaissance and hashtag Georgian January for the 18th century. Number one, go offline and get creative. Do pencil and paper sketches of pieces you've found. Print out objects that you're currently researching and make a mood board. Get out the sewing machine and try to recreate a technique you've been studying. Unplugging and getting creative is a great way to recharge.